Hi guys, welcome back. So today we're going to do rationalizing the denominator. What is rationalize? So we have to change the denominator to rational number without certs. So what is it actually? So we're going to change this one. If you look at the denominator, we have cert. And again, and then we're going to change that becomes no cert. Alright? So now we're going to look at this example. We're going to rationalize the denominator. So we have 2 over square root of 3. So how are we going to rationalize? We are going to multiply with square root of 3 as well. So we'll have... Ah, see, the denominator will have no set. Right, now we're going to rationalize this example. We have... And then we're going to multiply with the... Conjugate. See, if we look at the sign here, it's minus. So, the other one will be the opposite sign, that is plus. So, the first step is to expand. We're going to multiply square root of 5 with square root of 5. So, 5 we have, square root of 5 squared, and then plus with, right? So, we'll have, then plus. Right, and then 1 over, right, here, square root of 5 square, right, and here, and then negative, and then lastly, negative 1 times 1. So, if you look at here, we can simplify by cancelling it. Or, if... We want to use the simpler method. We can actually expand with a conjugate using this one. Alright? So, A minus B times A plus B is A square, square root of 5 square, Minus b square, so we have minus 1 square. Minus 1 square is actually minus 1. So we have here square root of 5 square. So we have 5 plus. This is actually the same thing. So we're going to plus 2 square root of 5 plus 1. Alright, the denominator will be 5 minus 1. So we'll simplify we'll get 6 plus 2 square root of 5 over 4. So if we notice 6, 4, 6, 2 and 4 here can be simplified. We can factorize 2 out. We'll have, alright, then over 4. Then the final answer will be 3 plus 6, 5 over 2. Alright, thank you.